This is gonna blow your mind. Yellowstone National Park is a living testament to nature's raw power, a place where geysers erupt, vibrant hot springs shimmer, and wild animals roam free. As the world's first national park, Yellowstone is both a sanctuary for wildlife and a showcase of Earth's inner workings, sitting atop a massive supervolcano. Its geothermal wonders and dramatic landscapes draw millions, offering not just recreation, but a deep connection to the planet's ancient forces. The park is a hub for scientific discovery, revealing secrets of volcanology, geology, and ecology in real time. Yellowstone's beauty is matched by its volatility, a reminder that beneath the serenity lies a restless, ever-changing world. Every tremor and plume of steam is a call to respect and protect this extraordinary wilderness for generations to come. On July 23, 2024, what began as a typical summer day at Yellowstone's Biscuit Basin quickly became a day that would be remembered for years to come. The sun shone brightly over the landscape, and the air was filled with the sounds of families and friends exploring one of the park's most famous geothermal areas. Tourists strolled the boardwalks, pausing to admire the vivid colors and steaming pools, completely unaware of the immense pressure building beneath the surface of Black Diamond Pool. The ground seemed stable but deep below, natural forces were gathering strength. Without warning, a deafening roar shattered the calm. A massive hydrothermal explosion erupted sending a violent column of boiling water, mud and rocks hundreds of feet into the air. The force of the blast was so powerful that it shook the ground and echoed across the basin. Boulders and debris rained down, smashing through the wooden boardwalk and leaving a gaping steaming crater where the tranquil pool had been just moments before. The landscape was instantly transformed, with shattered planks and scattered rocks marking the site of the explosion. Miraculously, despite the chaos and destruction, no one was hurt. The largest fragments of debris missed the main viewing platforms by mere chance, sparing the crowds from serious injury and turning what could have been a tragedy into a story of luck and survival. Rangers responded immediately, moving quickly to evacuate visitors and secure the area. Within hours, news of the dramatic blast had spread around the globe, fueling speculation and concern about the possibility of a larger volcanic event lurking beneath Yellowstone's surface. The explosion served as a stark reminder of the park's unpredictable and untamable power. In an instant, Yellowstone's beauty had transformed into a display of raw, awe-inspiring force, leaving visitors both amazed and cautious. For those who witnessed it, the event was an unforgettable encounter with the volatile heart of Yellowstone, a moment that forever changed their understanding of nature's power and unpredictability. When a sudden explosion rocked Yellowstone, scientists from the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory and the USGS sprang into action, mobilizing teams to the scene. Their mission, to uncover the cause of this dramatic event and determine if it signaled something far more dangerous. Was this the start of a volcanic eruption? The possibility sent a ripple of concern through the scientific community and the public alike, as Yellowstone's volcanic history is both fascinating and fearsome. Teams quickly set up seismic monitors and gas sensors pouring over real-time data. Careful analysis of seismic activity, ground deformation and gas emissions soon revealed that there was no evidence of magma movement beneath the surface. The culprit was identified, a hydrothermal explosion not a magmatic one. These blasts are caused by the rapid expansion of steam, not molten rock. Over many years, minerals had gradually sealed Black Diamond Pool's vent, creating a natural pressure cooker. Superheated water and steam built up beneath the surface, trapped by the mineral crust, until the pressure became too great to contain. When the mineral cap finally failed, the result was a violent and sudden release, an explosive burst of steam, scalding water and rocky debris that reshaped the landscape in an instant. Hydrothermal explosions are rare but well-documented features of Yellowstone. While they can be dangerous their effects are usually localized, unlike the catastrophic eruptions that many fear. Through clear and timely communication, scientists and park officials reassured the public that this event was not a sign of an impending supervolcano eruption, but rather a reminder of the park's dynamic nature. Instead, it was a dramatic display of Yellowstone's powerful natural processes, an awe-inspiring event that highlights the need for ongoing vigilance, scientific research, and respect for the forces that shape our planet. The July explosion was just the beginning. Biscuit Basin's underground system was left unstable, leading to a series of smaller, elusive eruptions. These eruptions were not as powerful as the initial blast, 
but they were frequent and unpredictable, causing concern among scientists and park officials. Scientists dubbed these Sasquatch eruptions, a fitting name as they were rarely seen by the naked eye, yet their presence was undeniable. These eruptions left clear evidence behind such as fresh mud deposits and new mineral formations, which were meticulously documented by researchers. New sensors detected multiple minor blasts, providing valuable data on the frequency and intensity of these events. And in May 2025, a webcam finally captured one on video, a significant breakthrough for the scientific community. The footage showed a sudden burst of water and sediment shooting skyward, a dramatic display of nature's power. These brief, unpredictable eruptions continued throughout the summer, each one a reminder of the basin's chronic instability. The area remained closed to the public as the risk of sudden blasts was ever-present and too dangerous to ignore. Rangers monitored the restricted area closely ensuring that no one ventured into the danger zone. The webcam footage transformed speculation into scientific fact providing concrete evidence of these elusive eruptions. This allowed researchers to study the frequency and intensity of these events in greater detail, leading to new insights into the geothermal activity of the area. Each eruption underscored the wisdom of keeping the public at a safe distance as the potential for danger was always present. Biscuit Basin had become a living laboratory a place where scientists could observe and study geothermal phenomena in real time. Its volatility now documented for all to see, Biscuit Basin stands as a testament to the dynamic and ever-changing nature of our planet. After the explosion, the National Park Service closed Biscuit Basin's boardwalk and car park to protect visitors. Though the closure was significant, it affected only a tiny fraction of Yellowstone's vast expanse. Most of the park, including Old Faithful, Grand Prismatic Spring and Yellowstone Lake, remained open and safe. Park officials worked hard to counter misinformation, emphasizing that Yellowstone's wonders were still accessible. Visitor numbers stayed strong, showing public confidence in the park's safety measures. Ranger talks and visitor centers updated their displays, turning the explosion into a powerful educational story. While the crater was off-limits, its story deepened visitors' respect for Yellowstone's dynamic landscape. The park balanced safety with exploration ensuring the spirit of discovery endured. The explosion spurred a major upgrade in Yellowstone's monitoring systems. Scientists installed new seismic and infrasound sensors to detect subtle signs of hydrothermal activity. In May 2025, a dedicated webcam began recording Black Diamond Pool, providing near-real-time visual data for researchers. These tools, combined with updated staff training and public education, created a robust safety net. Informational signs reminded visitors to stay on boardwalks and respect geothermal hazards. The enhanced monitoring not only protects people but also advances scientific understanding of hydrothermal systems. Data from the Sasquatch eruptions is helping refine models and improve hazard forecasting. Yellowstone's proactive approach blends cutting-edge science with practical safety, stewarding one of Earth's most active landscapes. The Biscuit Basin saga has opened the door for greater public participation in science, the USGS now invites citizen scientists to monitor webcam images and report signs of new activity. This crowdsourced vigilance strengthens the park's safety and deepens public engagement with Yellowstone. Yellowstone will always be a place of change, its shifting ground and boiling springs are part of its enduring allure. The 2024 explosion is now a chapter in the park's living story, a lesson in nature's power and the value of scientific inquiry. Thanks to vigilant rangers and researchers Yellowstone remains safe, wild, and wondrous. Its dynamic heart continues to inspire awe, and its secrets when revealed only make it more extraordinary.